Welcome back to Movies TV Mad. Of course, you can follow me on Twitter at Movies TV Mad. So according to IMDb, a site I can't trust as far as I can throw, they are saying, and this is all they're saying, by the way, that Nightwing is coming, directed by the ever irrepressible Chris McKay. Chris McKay has wanted to do a Nightwing movie for a very long time. He was going to do it, then he said he wasn't going to do it for reasons that nobody knows about, but it's on IMDb. So even though I don't trust IMDb, I choose for my glass to be half full and not half empty. I think this is coming. So we all know that Batgirl will introduce the DCEU's first appearance of Dick Grayson, a.k.a. Robin. We've seen the mural with Keaton's iconic Batman. How, how iconic was, was it to see that beautiful mural? Well done to the artist who did that for that movie. So there's two ways they can do this. They can introduce Dick Grayson and Robin in the Batgirl, as they're going to do. They can evolve his story so he becomes Nightwing. Or Chris McKay can go the Matt Reeves the Batman kind of journey where he has his own Earth somewhere. Maybe even Matt Reeves Earth, but any other Earth. We're in the multiverse now, baby. We can do whatever we want. Maybe he just gets to do his own Nightwing. But Chris McKay is an interesting one because you wouldn't call him a dark, gritty director, but he certainly loves and knows Nightwing. So I would think that option one is the way to go here. I think they're going to evolve Dick Grayson to Nightwing via introducing him in the Batgirl movie. This Batgirl movie is the way we're going. How many times do I read Screen Rant articles and they say the DCEU has decided to have self-contained movies and we know that's bullshit. Look at Batgirl. Look at The Flash. Aquaman's going to have some cameos as well. Peacemaker, right? Something we thought was going to be the most self-contained thing, apart from the Batman from DC Live Action this year, had a fucking Justice League cameo. And no matter what the propaganda merchants say, it was brilliant. So if we're doing this, we're doing this. So this is exciting because we're getting, we're building a universe. And I'm very interested what everyone's opinions will be. You know, if the bat, if the Batverse in the DCEU is deemed to be better after all said and done in the Flash movie and Batgirl, rather than Matt Reeves the Batman. Not that it matters. It's all the same company, right? Matt Reeves the Batman is awesome. And I believe the development of this Bat family with Michael Keaton's Batman as the head and the inspirational character in this is going to be a wonderful thing. And I really do hope not just as a DC stan, but as, as someone who went to film school and has dreams of directing, you know, in, you know in, a, in, a, in elite circles. You know, this is a big thing for directors like Chris McCut. You know, he's wanted this for so long. He has the capabilities of giving us an outstanding, and I mean outstanding, Dick Grayson and Nightwing. Nightwing is such a popular character. It's time, everyone. It's, not, it's time for Chris McKay's Nightwing movie. I think he can do a great job. What do you think? Drop a comment down. Let me know. Why don't you tag me on your timeline and let me know what you think? Do you want to see Chris McKay's Nightwing? How would you like to see it? In a self-contained Earth, like the Batman? Or would you like to see Robin in Batgirl and in this new Robin in the DCEU, Dick Grayson, evolve to Chris McKay's Nightwing? Let me know and I'll tell you my thoughts. But I've already told you my thoughts, but we'll get into it over here or on Twitter. This has been Movies TV Mad. I am Mick, your host with the most. Just ask your girlfriends and your wives. Like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit your notification bell so you never miss this perfection. And I'll see you again in the final pre-recorded video of today where we're talking about Zack Snyder's Rebel Moon. And I'll probably wish him a very happy birthday because after all, he is a fine fellow. See you again soon. I'll be back 
very shortly.